Hey everybody, good afternoon. It's around 3 p.m. on Thursday, July 15th, right in the center of the month. Happy July 15th. Um, uh, my last mineral vlog froze. I hope this one doesn't freeze because, you know, I realize this is exciting cinema. This is one take only. There's a lot, um, there's a lot at stake, right? It's like that last shot of Tarkovsky's The Sacrifice. You can really only do it once. Um, although I think I read that they did that twice, right? Well, anyway. Um, hi, welcome to Hoffman's Mineral Vlog. And today, um, what can I tell you about my life right now? Everybody's screaming and yelling on the internet. You gotta just stop, man. Just take it easy. Or leave me out of it. And you do leave me out of it. And like a schmuck, I go online and I look around and I see what people are yelling about and I get upset. So, man, you just gotta chill. You gotta chill. First of all, it's hot. You gotta chill with some relaxing mineral water oh yeah now today's pick is interesting we've been all around the globe we've been to all the eastern european nations you know, slovenia right didn't we go to slovenia slovakia uh, uh sokovia we were in georgia greece uh we were in the andes mountains we were in denmark a lot up there in scandinavia denmark Spain, Portugal, France, Germany, and now we go to merry old England. Do 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 do. She looks interesting. I'd like to be her friend. Got a lot of cool neighbors. Now this looks like a gin bottle, doesn't it? Um. Uh, some of the other bottles look like wine, look like vodka. This looks like gin. Bam, 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 bam. Hilden, natural mineral water, gently sparkling. Yeah, the Brits are chill, man. Um, and it's by appointment to Her Majesty the Queen, or we've all heard of her, uh, supplier of natural mineral water, Hilden Limited Hampshire, established 1989. So this is fairly recent. To put this in British terms, this is after Queen's performance at Live Aid, okay? That's how the Brits determine there's like, you know, A.D. and B.C. 1989, a number, another summer. Um, let's do it, all right? I was going to look at their website. Do I want to know, like, where it's from? It says natural, this is like from a spring, Bottle that Hilden Mineral Aquifier Source in Hilden in in, you know what I one thing I do love about England is like they, they um, the addresses take forever right they got the county they got the area. Hill uh Hilden Limited in Broughton, which I've never heard of, Hants H A N T S I've heard a lot of the of the uh, counties in England but never Hants. Something tells me that that's not the most luxurious spot let me do a quick i'm not going to go to their website because i don't care but i do want to know where hans england is and then it has the zip code which i think they call postal code and it's like a thousand letters and, and numbers hans england not pants hans there hampshire I've heard of hampshire is hampshire and hans the same thing hans where is it in hans <laughs> No, it's um, Portsmouth, I've heard, Bournemouth, I've heard, Winchester. Where is Hans? This is, uh... all right, I'm sorry. I know it's boring to watch somebody Google, but let me just do another one. Broughton, Hans, Hanks, I wrote, Hanks, UK. All right, and then we'll stop. There it is. There it is. It's a little bit of nothing. It's in the south, kind of near, it's like halfway between London and Plymouth. And Plymouth is um, on your way to Penzance in Cornwall, where I've been fairly recently, and I really recommend it. Cornwall is dynamite. Hans is not too far from uh, Bath and Bristol. I've been to Bath too. Drank the waters at Bath, so maybe this will taste a little bit like the bath water. <laughs> All right, let's do it. And it has a nice little embossment here. H, H, a backwards H and a regular H. Red rum. Let's do it. Not too much of a fizz. It's a couple of bubbles coming out. Mind you that this is, uh, as they say, um, 
gently sparkling. Oh, I could use it. I need it. I need to cleanse my whole life. Wow, this is great. This is a great water. It really is. And I'm going to tell you why. The, the um, carbonation is low, but the bubbles that are there are adding a bitter flavor. And there is a wide palate. It's a strong, bitter flavor. Well, the Brits would do that. Bitter lemon, right? I need a haircut. I need to shave. I need to wash my face more. I need to get my act together. No way, man. I'm all positive today. Today's been good. We got, I checked on my strawberry, my strawberries, my tomatoes in the back. They're doing great. We're going to have some tomato. We're going to have Hoffman's tomato vlog soon, man. We're going to be rocking out with tomatoes. Oh, yeah. I love it. I got a second one of these on accident. I ordered this one. I didn't get this one from the local supermarket near me. I did get this one on salaciousdrinks.com for a pretty penny. And um, I, when the box came, there were two of these. And I went, what the hell? And I looked, and I accidentally hit two. So it was my fault. Oh, man. This is really good. This is giving me a nice boost in the middle of the day. Hilden. Do any of my British friends drink Hilden? I have a few British friends who listen. Blech. All right. What else can I tell you? Um, uh, working hard. i uh, watched some good movies and television lately. I'm writing some stories about those. Um, I just literally hit stop on... I watched the entire series of Schmigadoon. And you'll be... A, Reading about that in the Schmigazette soon. Really like Schmigadoon. I think I'm embargoed. I don't know if I'm supposed to say that, but what are they going to do? Uh, I think Schmigadoon is great. It's such positive energy, and it's clever, and um, I love that Sicily, uh, Sicily Strong. I do. I want to be her friend. Is that weird? I've never really paid attention to her before. I don't know too much about her. I know she's on Saturday Night Live, which is a big, big a zone of of uh, I don't I you know I very rarely watch um, that show uh, because um, I don't I just don't think to do it oh, I froze again wow this is so cool I guess I freeze after some day what you know I have an editor this machine's like shut up we don't care about your relationship with Saturday Night Live, you think you're too cool for school. I kind of do, though. I just don't, it's just not fun. So the thing about Saturday Night Live is, is the, this is one of the few things that has been made so much better by the modern age. Saturday Night Live is 90 minutes from end to end, right? With two musical numbers. Most of the time, the musical guests are not just in my, they're just not what I like. It's pop music, which I, I'm not really into. Or it's rap, which I generally don't really get into. Once in a blue moon, there's an artist I like. Um, or it's country. Or it's like pop country, too. It's not even like real country. So it's not my thing. And then occasionally I have like a rock band that I, I kind of like, but I don't like that. It's just not my thing. I'm, I'm, I'm very committed to the music that I like. And I listen. I don't just listen to classic rock. I'm not just in my home playing Jethro Tull. I, I do listen to modern music. It's just not the type of shit that is on SNL. Fine. I, I neither condemn nor glorify uh, the people who are playing music on, on SNL. Um, and so that's two sketches out of the way that I'm probably not that interested in. Um, and then, you know, the, the, the very topical cold open is rarely funny. It's just like, what's in the news? And let's just exaggerate it. And it's like, it's just lame. But there is, you know, for a 90 minute show, there's usually one good sketch. And guess what? It's going to be on YouTube the next morning. And that's how you do it. And if that works for SNL, if that's good for the brand, if they're getting enough eyeballs and advertising, it'll keep it alive. So I guess, you know, I'm happy to j join in on the bandwagon. Um, but to watch the show, oh, I just can't do it. I just can't do it. And, and listen, it wasn't that much better in the glory days. You want to sit down and watch all 90 minutes of, of a season from, you know, the early, the Bill Murray years 
There's a lot of dead weight in those two, you know. I mean, those guys were cool. Bill Murray. I mean, you know, all the all the classics. Belushi. And I like some of the movies that have. I like some of the movies and some of the characters that have come out of it. I like the Coneheads. I like the Coneheads in general. And I like the Coneheads movie, which maybe puts me in a position. And I like the Frank Zappa song, Coneheads. Um, and I like, uh, you know, I like the Blues Brothers. I'm not a lunatic. I mean, the Blues Brothers is great. So, all right, I got to go. The neighbors are here. Um, I got to run. Have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon. So long, and see ya.